all this time of finding the right dimensions. I think I finally found them. All right, so now we're going to go meet Sebastian outside the Slytherin room. I think he got another spell for us to learn. Another unforgiving spell. I gotta remember I corrected the button so I'm still trying to took me a minute. Another thing, I think I finally found the right dimensions for this thing. For my recording. It took me a minute to find it, but I think I got it. Okay, now I'm going to meet Sebastian. Was there anything else here? Revelio. Okay, we did it already. Oh, how fun a slide! You must try it! table. You're here. Brilliant. I received your owl. What happened with Ominous? I told him none of us will be able to avoid dark magic forever. So the more we know about Salazar Slytherin and the dark arts, the better prepared we'll be. Unfortunately, only a Gaunt knows the location of the Scriptorium's entrance, and Ominous won't tell me. Hmm. Perhaps I should have a chat with Ominous. You? I suppose it's worth a try. But don't get your hopes up. Ominous is annoyingly stubborn. Nothing new. I know where he is. I'll lead you to him and then leave you to it. Come on. He's this way. Q. 
keep an eye out. Never know who's watching. Although that hasn't stopped us before. Strictly speaking, it has. We were caught. Damned poltergeist. Such a nuisance. There he is. Good Rebellion. luck. What are you doing here? Hello, Ominous. Do you have a moment? What is it? What have you and Sebastian been up to now? I owe you an apology, Ominous. I wasn't honest with you before about the Undercroft. Sebastian did show it to me. He wanted me to have a safe place to practice some spells to try and catch up to the other fifth years. He didn't think you'd mind. <sighs> I suppose that makes sense. It's just Sebastian's been pestering me lately about something and I'm frustrated with him. Don't tell me he's still going on about... What was it? A scriptorium? He told you about that? He did. We were talking about Hogwarts founders and he mentioned it. Wouldn't say much more, though. Yes, well, he seems to think it contains the answer to saving Anne. I think it's likely full of dark magic that is better left untouched. Wait, you've never been inside? Of course not. I only know about it because of my favourite aunt, Noctua. She thought like I do. Didn't agree with the family on the use of dark magic. In fact, she'd hoped to convince my family that there was more to Salazar Slytherin than worshipping pure blood status. She'd heard of this scriptorium and thought its contents might shed some light on him. She even found the secret entrance in this very corridor. She wrote regularly to my father about her efforts to gain access, and then she simply vanished. No one else ever tried to enter. I understand your caution. I'm sorry about your aunt. Don't you want to find out what happened to her? Aunt Noctua went down this path with good intentions and lost her life. I don't want the same to happen again. You don't know that history will repeat itself. Besides, you said your aunt thought like you. This could honor her memory, get you answers about Slytherin and Sebastian answers for Anne. Your aunt pursued this alone. We could do it together. Hmm. I see what you've done here, and I confess, you've convinced me. I didn't think it possible. Very well. I shall tell you what I know. Fetch Sebastian, I'll wait. I hope I... we don't regret this. Sebastian! Over here! Revelia just grant access to the scriptorium. Now you'll share? You wouldn't tell me... Incendiary! Begged. It wasn't you who told me what I needed to hear. Opening the entrance has something to do with threes. Well... Three heads are better than one. It's two heads are better than one. And by that logic, three is better than two. Simple mathematics, Ominous. Flupendo! Descendo! Revelio. Remember, three braziers are involved. Incendio! Someone was actually listening. I do that. Occasionally. Revelio! Descendio! Levioso! Revelio! Rebellion. Alohomora.
something's happening. I hope we're ready for this. I'm supposed to be going straight there, but... Relief of a person facing a snake. That must be the voice I hear. I must prove my point. I do not need to use the dark words of my family. When I reach the scriptorium, I will find evidence. Irvin's my brother. He knows how I access the corridor's entrance, and there is no straight path. To reach the scriptorium, it's a maze with many challenges. Okay. Revelio! The voice is ancient, sinister. You hear a voice. It started when you repaired that relief. I hear a whisper saying, speak to me. I'm a parcel mouth. I can hear and speak to snakes. Nearly all known parcel mouths are descended from Salazar Slytherin. I'd like to be able to talk to snakes. You might not want the ability to speak parcel tongue. It's often associated with dark wizards. I haven't spoken it in ages, but I'd wager if I speak it now, the door will open. I'm hoping you're having second thoughts. I see no reason we should stop now. It's ironic. When I left home, I vowed to leave the Dark Arts behind, and yet here I am. Stand back. I can't believe I'm doing this. It worked! Ominous, you possess a rare ability indeed. Between the two of you, I'm starting to feel left out. Between the two of us? I... Never mind. Revelio! There's no clear way forward. Like a maze. Salazar said you most likely wanted this to be difficult to solve. Revelio! The door we came from, it closed. Incendium! one gate ahead. Then look closely at each gate for clues. Hey, Salazar Slither and buried this tutorial in Hogwarts. I'm afraid I should lose my way around these dark corridors and I'm a descendant, yet I feel unwelcome. Fighting these brazers in the corridor is helping. I shan't lose heart. Challenge by challenge, I'll make my way through. This journal entry, it mentions getting... The dial requires focus. Ah, uh, not to have said the same. It may take practice to solve it. That didn't sound good. Salazar Slytherin didn't make this easy. Incendio. Descendo. I can't, I can't even see this thing. I gotta turn up the gamma. I don't know how it's looking on video, but on mine, I can't even see it. Um, image calibration, I'll turn up the brightness.
adjust the brightness. Here we go. What's the damn help? You know what? Wow, dumbass. I, I, I don't use the spell. I don't use the spell often, so I can't really make out what the hell. Genuinely couldn't make out what the hell it was. Matching the symbols did open it. Was about to do that myself, but you got to it first. <laughs> Extraordinary this journey is painful but rewarding. We shall soon find a scriptorium and discover until secrets regarding our house founder. Salazar Slytherin intended more than what we've become, I know it. Noctua references painful and arduous challenges, but also rewards. Painful. That's the part I'm wary of. All I heard was rewards. Keep going. Revelio! So this door. Another gate. Seems Slytherin like to play games. Plus run in the family. Look in a mirror, Sebastian. That sounded promising. Another dial solved. Impressive. Nice. Might as well just keep this on there. Lumos. Fish Mountain. Whatever the hell that's supposed to be. Another. Not the welcoming sort, was he? Excellent work. We're another step closer to the scriptorium. Go the dial, it struck me in my face if I were a serpent. We must find my way forward for my family's sake. We should not require children to conform in old traditions. This auditorium must have proof that there is more to our legacy than meets the eye. Ominous. Your aunt wanted to change your family's traditions. She did. And she was my favorite person in the world for it. I spotted something ahead. Looks troubling. The gate! I think we're locked in. Again! Rebellion! Salazar Slytherin is not yet finished with us. I've lost hope. I'm locked in. I heard a scream and saw the tortured faces. The only way forward is with an unforgivable curse. Even if I wanted to cast it, I have no one upon whom to do so. Salazar Slytherin created a malicious and challenge indeed. In my last correspondence to my brother, I didn't send him here. I invited him here. Now, if he looks for me alone, I have led him to his death. Despite our differences, I wish him no ill. I wish we had parted on better terms. Wait, so she used it on her brother? Oh, wow, so she killed her brother. Ominous. A skeleton. And Noctua's last journal entry. 
She mentions being trapped here, blocked by an unforgivable curse. This is where she died. This is where we'll die. I shouldn't have listened to either of you. Ominous, I'm truly sorry about your aunt. But I know what to do. It's going to be difficult. You said you know what to do. Tortured faces on the door and Crucios etched into the stone. My guess is if we cast the Cruciatus curse, the door will open. That's why Noctua died. She had no one to cast the curse on. Ominous has the most experience with this. He should cast it. You seem to be in Ominous's favor. Will you ask him about this? Mm. He does seem a bit cross with you. I'll speak with him. Good. Work your magic, so to speak. Wish we had some liquid luck. All of this could have been avoided. Ominous. I hadn't imagined we'd end up trapped like this. Salazar Slytherin did. He's to blame for many unimaginable things. I overheard you and Sebastian, and I won't do it. The Cruciatus Curse is pure torture, I would know. Sebastian told me a little of what happened when you were young. Sounds as if you had no choice. <sighs> Should have known he would have told you. <sighs> and one always has a choice. I'm as guilty as the worst of my family. Unforgivable curses won't work unless you really mean them. I had to want to cause pain, and for that I shall never forgive myself. That spells the reason I have no family left. You and Sebastian will need to sort out another solution. If you cast Crucio, you will regret it forever. No, the hell I won't. What do we do now? Ominous is not going to cast the Cruciatus Curse again. Ridiculous! As if dying in here is a better option than casting a damned spell. <sighs> it's up to us. I can teach you Crucio, or I can cast it on you. Wait. You didn't say you knew how to cast Crucio. Because I'm not sure I do. Ominous knows that, yet he's left us no choice. I don't yearn to follow in Noctua Gaunt's footsteps. I think I can cast it if I have to. Oh, I'm just seeing something that confused the hell out of me. Oh, but you must cast it on me. Um. I'll go with the middle one, because I don't know if it's going to kill somebody or not. I want to learn the <clears throat> curse, but I won't cast it on you. You need to cast it on me. I shan't forget this. I should have looked up what this does. I'm ready. Yeah. 
Leave with me being a 50 here. Are you right? <clears throat> that pain, it was excruciating. But I'll survive. Let's keep moving. We made it. Salazar Slytherin Scriptorium. I can't believe we're here. Revelio. I fear we shall never come to an accord. I cannot persuade you. <clears throat> Even one of them to listen. I had dared hope <clears throat> that Godric's thoughts were aligned with my own, that he understood why the caliber. <clears throat> Excuse me. <clears throat> A student needed to be exceptional, but he has fallen prey to the ridiculous notion that muggleborns are somehow capable as pure bloods. He was furious when I expressed my displeasure at his thoughts on the matter. Thoughts he had not quite yet put the voice into. Rebellion. Sebastian, ominous. There's a book just here. You found something. You two go ahead. Let me know what's in it. I'll wander around a bit. What do you think? Looks like a spell book of some kind. This is incredible. A Hogwarts founder's possession. What an honor. Still can't believe Ominous never told me about his aunt and what she found. What will you do with Slytherin's spell book? What I do with every book. Read it. Having professors as parents ingrained that habit early on. But I can do that later. For now, I say we explore this room. It's breathtaking. Revelio. I don't want to leave, but I owe you. Both of you. Without both of you, we'd never have made it this far. We were lucky. We could have died. We must swear never to do this again. Ominous. About your aunt. Please, Sebastian. I meant what I said before. We swear, right now, never to engage in anything to do with dark magic again. Understood. I'm truly sorry about your aunt, Ominous. I suppose after all this, I am grateful to know what happened to her. Thank you. I actually want to go back because I want to... <clears throat> it was a room that... Uh... Oh, it was in that hallway. Why do I have to go back this way? Rebellion. 
Hold up, wait a minute. What are the hallway? Where's it here? How nice to see you, my young friend. Wasn't it? I'm trying to find that hallway I was down. Was that it? No, it wasn't. This is the door. There it is. Let's check this out real quick. Revelio. Can't hold my breath for that. No, I'm going to ask her this You time. said that 40 years ago. Did you see that? She looked at me. My dear mound of shoulders, I'm afraid it was I that drew her gaze. Uh, I'm going to do it. You should before the next century. Revelio. everything I guess very cool what was that 